Ok, let's do the meditation. Ok, close your eyes. Then. Okay, close your eyes and uh, you would notice whenever you close your eyes, your fantasy started. You know, it's not uh, depends on your intention, your consciousness. Uh, picks up so many things in your mind. And maybe you start chasing one image, one particular image, or one particular story. Please observe how your consciousness is moving in your mind when you close your eyes. Eventually, you can go deeper and find just perfect silence and the perfect nothingness, but uh, no one can jump into or dive into such a state. First, we have to go through the assumption. Okay, in order to be easier, let's imagine you are walking in the woods. It's a forest walking. So you can imagine your woods. So as vivid as possible, you visualize your own forest and please walk or please hike on the trail. No sunshine reaches you, or some of them, some of the uh, sunshine can reach you. You know, it's up to you. You create your wonderful walking story. Don't stop. Keep walking. The tribe must be um, not straight. And you sometimes need to climb up, climb down, or you need to jump on the small streams. Keep walking. Keep walking, but don't rush. You can enjoy the sight. Beautiful greens, flowers, Maybe mushrooms, birds singing. You find a rabbit or deer.
maybe you find the uh, beautiful meadows, bright meadows in front of you and uh, crossing by. And finally, you find the, your favorite big tree. You know, we have the favorite tree friends. So you find your friend. So when you find your favorite tree, you touch it. Maybe you hug the tree. And lean on your back. Or sit down under the tree and feel it. The tree is your true friend. The tree understands you. Tree understands who you are. The tree understands you are love itself. The tree understands your beautiful mind. The tree understands your dream and hope your potentiality, your talent, your ability, your history, and everything. So feed your friend. Feed your friend and then focus on that feeling. So not to focus on the tree anymore, Focus on your feeling. Warm, secure feeling. Feeling love. Feeling joy in your mind. And focus on the smell of the air in the forest. So enjoy the aroma. Then focus on the joy, not the aroma itself. Focus on the joy. The aroma triggered your joy, and you feel your joy. That tree triggered your love, and you feel love. Then now, listen. Listen to the sound in the forest. As you know, in the forest, there is a very different uh, kinds of uh, sounds because so many different frequencies including the really high frequencies our physical ear cannot catch. But our mind knows those frequencies. So you listen to the sound through 
through your physical ears and you listen to the uh, voice of God by your mind. So what do you feel? Your mind is uh, kind of a so soothing and calm down and um, closer, closer to silence, maybe. So focus on that uh, state of mind. Then now, think of someone in your mind, probably whom you really care, you really like, and observe your feeling, what kind of um, Sensation and the feeling uh, comes up in your mind when you are imagining or visualizing that person. So you feel excited or you feel comfortable, peace. So once you reach your sensation and the feeling, forget about that image and just focus on the sensation and the feeling. This is a very, very important practice that whatever you perceive or you imagine, such images or appearances, they are just a doorway to enter what you have in your mind. So your peaceful feeling is not of that person. You have that feeling in other ones. And through the image of that person, that the beautiful quality is pulled out and you experience. So please nurture and treasure your own feeling. So okay now, think of something, what you think it's problem you have to overcome you have to solve. Is there anything in your life right now, such things? You need to solve. You need to conquer. You need to break through. So you visualize you remember that issue and then observe what kind of sensation and the feeling 
is spread out in your mind. And what kind of reaction your body shows. And tell yourself, if it's not comfortable, you don't need to keep this sensation. You can choose something else. So you tell yourself like that, but uh, still you don't know how, how to change it. So now ask the Holy Spirit to lighten up all sensations, all reactions, and I like to have the peaceful mind instead. This is a beautiful prayer. And observe Holy Spirit answers. And the tension is getting fewer, 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 lower, lower, lower. And then you feel a complete relaxation. And let's go next. You say this statement to yourself. This is about you. This is about true self. God is but love. And therefore, so am I. God is a patriarch, and therefore, so am I. Tell yourself, God is love, and therefore, so am I. So you repeat this statement and observe how you feel. God is love, and therefore, so am I. God is love, and therefore, so you are. You, so are you. You are love, because you live in love. 
you are love. So you need only love. Everything you perceive is love. And therefore, you are love itself. You are love, and therefore, whatever you perceive, it's love. Here, only peace exists. Only peace exists. Your business is to stay in peace, and the peace itself moves everything perfectly for you. You are love, so your business is to stay in love. So love itself moves everything perfectly for you. This is uh, the experience we need to hug and hug and hug and uh, accumulation of love experience. Every day, let's experience Peace has the power to move everything perfectly for you. Practice to stay in love and experience that the love itself moves everything perfectly for you. As long as you try to control things, try to adjust yourself to something, you miss such a beautiful experience. So let the temptation go, temptation to control things, temptation to adjust yourself, Temptation to keep the guilty feeling, sense of luck, and so on. Remember what kind of a sensation and a feeling you have in this forest with your friend tree. So now, in the end, it's your turn to give. Back your love and peace to your tree and uh, all the creatures in the forest. What can you give? What do you want to say to this beautiful love itself? Say something in your mind. Maybe simply, I love you too. 
was simply thank you. You are truly in grace because you receive it. You are just like a most beautiful painting piece. Then in the end, one more time, God is but love, and therefore, so am I. God is but love, and therefore, so am I. Then bring back the physical sensation that you are with the big tree. And one more time, you start walking in the woods. Walking slowly on the trail. Then you find the brightness in front. Yes, again, it's a meadow. So you slowly, slowly walk into the brightness. Maybe so bright, so probably you remember the uh, grounding line and bring back their complete physical sensation. And when you are ready, please open your eyes. Thank you so much.